don't cut off. See, I done overcame almost everything. I done made it through the rain. I kept going, I kept going, I kept going. Yeah. See, I was fighting battles, going through the pain. I was waiting for a change. Now I'm glowing, now I'm glowing, now I'm glowing. Welcome back to our channel. As you can see, I slacked off and didn't do an intro, so here I am, floating head and all. But if you are new here, my name is Mimi Meza, and my family is the DMK family. And we would really appreciate it if you could consider subscribing, and if you are returning, thank you so much for the continued support. So back in March, we made this video of us reacting to the songs that were made for us, and you could actually see the decor in the room. As you guys have seen with us having birthdays and events back to back, I never actually got to post a video of us decorating the room. So if you guys see us wearing sweaters in the middle of June in Arizona, mind your business. Keating, I'm keating. <laughs> like I mentioned, some of these clips were pre-recorded. I just wanted to show you guys a quick before and after of what our room aesthetically pleasing backdrop looks like. But first, here here is a clip of Manny and I trying boba for the very first time. Why did I do a floating head, you may ask? Because I look like this. I just asked Manny what he prefers because he got coconut and I hate coconut. So um, he tried mine and I guess my popping boba literally pops in your mouth. So I asked him what does he prefer, the bobas in his mouth not popping or mine's that pop? And he said he enjoys the balls in his mouth. Not exactly like that, but... He I said he mean, enjoyed his because they don't pop and he gets to swirl them around. I did not say that. <laughs> he did, guys. He's a little camera shy or whatever. <laughs> swirl them around, baby. Coconut. Oh, I see a bottle in there. See, mine's pop in my mouth. That's weird. It looks like raisins. Como se dice? Pasa. Raisin. Hi. Raisin. I'm looking to oh, sure. I'm looking to get some stuff for the bedroom. Holy chucks. Baby. Holy chucks. Not chucks. Anyway, um, so that it could be aesthetically pleasing in the back. So I'll show you guys a little before and after. I think these would be nice, babe. Um, we can put like two and then like one little thing in the middle in our window. So it looks pretty. What do you think? I've been looking for bookshelves for the longest. And I keep seeing them on Amazon, but they're very like um, decor on the sides, like very bougie. And I want something very minimalist, so it just looks nice back there. So I really liked those. I just needed some help from Babe carrying those. I'm gonna get some of these so that they go with the rest of the decor, um, like our entertainment center. Hi guys, our channels. And then we need a new clothes hamper. So what do you think we do those or not? So I'm looking for some plantas because I have this whole mindset that in the middle of my shelves I want to put a planta in the middle and I'm getting this on footage because he's telling me to try somewhere else but if I don't find it I'm going to come back for that planta. Not that one. No, which which one then? I like the middle one. That one. This one. I think that one's too small. I wanted to resaltar. Not that. One itself, that one you could no, we'll thing. come back with this one. Or what about this one? That one's pretty. No, not that. Well, Manny took a video of the little mueblecito that we had right there. This is the stuff that was inside that I need to organize. I'm thinking of painting these white. They have like these ugly little leather um, handles on them. So we're going to pop these off and put something silver maybe so it matches the vibe. These are the muebles that I was talking about at Target. Manny's going to build them. Don't mind his hair. Work hair, huh? Fashionable hair. For a workman. And then all of this, guys, is my clean clothes. Que no he colgado. I need to get to that. This is a diaper changing area that I had and I haven't used because obviously I don't change the babies there anymore. So we're going to get rid of that. We're going to make this little area of the room a little vibe so that we could record on the vanity, which is clean. I feel like it doesn't matter if it's clean. If there's stuff in that wall, that cochinero, it doesn't look good. Oh, and we need to get another thing for here because... We never bought that. I don't know why. A little before moment, and then we're going to show you guys the after. So Manny finished this little bookshelf right there. 
I'm still not done with that pile of clothes. I'm sitting here because I'm tired. I'm gonna go through all these so that he could paint. So he put the planta right there so he could kind of make sure that it um, had enough spacing because I want those there for sure. He's gonna set this one up. Guys, I don't know if you guys have watched Walking Dead, but I watched literally all of them except for what is it this last season, babe? Mm -hmm. So I told Manny that I was willing to start it all over again, just so I could catch up. Huh, babe? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I used to be obsessed with this, but I've already watched it all so long ago that I don't even remember, so I'm excited all over again. So here's a quick little glimpse of what the Mueblecita looked like before. It was very brown, very boho vibes, but that's just not the vibe for me. So we painted it, and here is the finishing result. <laughs> You guys are so cute coloring. You're coloring the doggies? And she's coloring chicken nuggets. <laughs> Let me see your bow. What's your bow on what's on your bow? What's on your bow? What's on your bow? What is it? It, what is it? It's a uh, Coco Melon, Yo Yo, and JJ? Yeah? Oh, I like it. It's so cute. Yay! Let me see your teeth. So, that is the final result. I have the lights on just so you guys could kind of see what it looks like with the lights on. I did do some changing on top of the bed. I am not done. I'm going to put some lights around the bed. Um, I just like how it's more of a, you know, aesthetic vibe. I didn't really need any of this up, but I did put it up just so it could be more aesthetically pleasing when I am recording. Since I am trying to do more lives now, my vanity is not really organized. Kimmy actually helped me clean it up. I wanted decor a little bit nicer on here. Right now, it's really meant for what it's for, which is getting ready. <laughs> but I want to get it more, um, you know, more aesthetically pleasing. I am not done. This is where I edit. Um, well, in my room, not in the office. This is just my room area. My purses right here, those are just my everyday purses. Thinking of adding some shelves on here so that I could add my everyday purses a little bit nicer um, and not just have them everywhere. But here, let me turn off the lights so you guys can kind of see how cute it looks with the lights off i love it it's very relaxing to me i like it you like it mama i like it too you like it too um so yeah i love how it looks you know very pink vibes everything's pink the baskets up here are not gonna be forever um here let me turn on the lights again at least the vanity lights so you guys could see a little better um, so like I said, the bags here, um, I'm gonna get rid of a lot of them to be honest. This is just what I've recently wore. I want to add the little shelves up here. Um, everything on here is really more, like I said, I don't need it. I just added it so it could look pretty. I just have them there for now because that's where the baby's bows were at. And as you can see for now, I use this, um, in replacement of the little mueble that I had here, which was the twins' little diaper changing area. This is the ugly brown one. So, this um right here, if you notice, it's just like a little what is it? Um banquito type thing with the planta. I really was gonna leave that spot empty to you know have more space for my tripods and stuff, but I had to put that in if you notice it scooted all the way up because the twins would find that as their hiding spot. If you're a mom, you know what I mean. Twins, yeah, it's a mess. I got this planta actually really cheap at Burlington, I think it is. And I was going for something more green, but nothing really stuck out a whole lot. And I thought that's going to, you know, pop because it's white on the gray wall. Um, the muebles, again, I got at Target. These I got at Target as well. The little green plantitas, again, it's just a pop of color. Those are from Five Below. I believe these lights are also from Five Below. Um, one of them is from Five Below, one of them is from Shein. Um, I've had this sign for the longest. It's always said the same thing because I don't even know where the words are at. But hey, subscribe to the channel. 
I have also had this since like, oh, I don't even know, 2016, 2015 for a birthday. I love that Polaroid camera. Um, this planta right here, I also, I think, got at Ross or hmm, Burlington, I think. I don't know. But as you can see, I'm going through my boxes. I can't find the big one for my um, Neverfull, but Manny's little gift is here because I have never had Prada. And it is a very proud moment of mine. A um, couple little boxes here. This is a mueble that Manny um, painted. Guys, this had a major glow up. I don't know if you guys remember the ugly little um, is it handles, the little leather handles. They were not it. These ones are so cute. Manny screwed these on. He got these from Home Depot. He literally just sprayed it all. And it just looks a lot more modern. It gives it a better glow. So we are in the process of trying to get new flooring. But we don't even know if we're going to be staying here for a while. So yeah, we don't know about that. We did add some curtains. Fun fact, we did have curtains back in the day. But that's when the twins had their crib here. And they pulled them. So... They are back now. I love these curtains because they're super dark. Like, if I close them, it literally feels like nighttime. So, I did add a white one in the middle just so I could get some daylight in. Again, I've had that M. I don't even know for how long. Um, this is, again, my little... doesn't look as pretty, but this is what I need for the babies. And I haven't put it in there. I might, just so you don't see all of that. Um, my little ring light. This is kind of where I do my video reels and stuff. The little hat is not staying there. <laughs> Manny just got it for me, so I tossed it there. Um, guys, I have a really crazy story about this mirror. Like, this mirror is, it goes back. And I need to actually get out of here to tell you guys a story. But this mirror is, it has its history. Huh, Mama? Yeah, yeah. Again, getting rid of this. This right here, um, I'm not really happy with. As you can see, it's all scratched with the paint. This is just more my workstation. I usually have the like, candles on, edit, a couple things to make it like a little office in my room. But I, as you guys know, have my office. My TV, some advice on what to do with these monitos. I've been wanting to get rid of them. But then again, they all have meaning to me. This is my first time I went to Vegas with Manny. This is our wedding monito that he gave me. Manny, um, if you know, you know, he knows how to do the stitch voice. Hi, it's Manny. <laughs> so we love stitch. And that was his first monito he ever, ever gave me. So I kind of just tossed him up there for now. But give me some ideas on where to put it because or if I should just get rid of them. So again, up here, I just kind of have some stuff that mean a lot to me. Kimmy gave me that years ago for Mother's Day. Uh, this monito I think Kimmy gave to me. Uh, my lotions and then again this is just a mess because it's just what I use on the everyday and yeah I need to fix this up but on the tops uh, Kimmy gave me that years ago David Manny if you guys watch your Christmas video that was one of his gifts for us I think I want to change that out too because it's been up there for a while the little stars again they just light up for no reason just to be nice this was white and I just added marble to make it more marble vibes. I'm thinking of adding marble there too or if anything just removing this. I don't know. So I did change the cuadro that I had up here which I loved but it was gold so I wasn't feeling that anymore. You guys want to know something funny? So Kimmy um, read this and she's like mom that sounds so possessive. Forever and ever. Forever and always. But, fun fact, Manny and I say that every single night to each other. I have no idea why the video just randomly stops there. But, as always, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And we will be back with another video. And we don't play. It's the fan. DMK. DMK. Living good, going hard every day. If they mad, we not tripping, let them hate. It's the fan.